always stay in your lane or not. When you are driving down the road, you should always stay in your lane, unless you can't, like when a lane is blocked, for example. Obviously, you need to be mindful of other cars and drivers if you change lanes. And if you need to pass someone, be sure to do it safely. In life, we might hear the same expression of stay in your lane when referring to a work environment. It's best to do one's job and to stay focused on one's goal while not interfering with someone else's duties in a meddling way. But how about in the church? Is it okay to not stay in your lane? Yes. What I'm saying here is that it's okay and actually good to reach across the lanes, all the lanes that you can, and to connect. Let me explain further. To check in on people, to see how they're doing, to find out what they're going through or what they've gone through, to let them know how much you care. These are ways of being a community and how wonderful it is when that community is one of faith and points to Jesus Christ and his teachings. In these days of so much turmoil and strife, what a great blessing it is to extend the hand and the heart of compassion across the lanes of life, to reach others where they are. You may do much more good than you could possibly realize. And if you need a Bible verse to give you some motivation to get out of your life lane a little bit, here are some good ones. Romans 12, 15. Rejoice with those who rejoice. Mourn with those who mourn. Galatians 6, 2. Carry each other's burdens, and in this way, you will fulfill the law of Christ. And last but not least, love yourself, love your neighbor as yourself. Matthew 22, 39. There are more scriptures to back up this thinking of me message of reaching out to others. If you're curious, let's talk. Here's a prayer for today. Dear God, thank you for how people have reached out to us in good times and in tough times. Help us to do the same with people who we know or who we meet. Amen. Be blessed, Zebulon United Methodist Church. Please share your blessings.